Hello friends, this is Prem Asim Jain and welcome to MongoDB tutorial. So in this lecture we are going to learn about the save command. So people rarely use save because they use insert or update to modify. But save is another a good option. And what it gives us is a direct replace. Like it doesn't give you a lot many facility which update gives but it's like straightforward and mainly can be used when you're trying to update something or if the thing is not there it can you know insert it like absurd so let's try and understand you just have to like uh, do db.collection.save and you have to pass a document and whatever document you pass whether it's going to get inserted or updated it depends on the underscore id field if your docu the document you're trying to insert does not, does not have ID, then it's going to insert. Or if ID, uh, if it has an ID but it doesn't match the existing records, then it's going to insert. That means if there is no match for the ID, it's going to insert. However, if it finds a match for its ID field, then it's going to update the current existing record or it's going to replace the existing record with whatever you pass up in there for example they have just passed this stuff and then it got inserted however when they tried the id the record they were able to find the record in database and it got replaced or upserted by this document let's try a hands-on stuff this link you can find and I would recommend you to go and try this hands on. However, I will do this for you. So let's say we have these all records and we gonna save some record. So for example, I have to save this record by making some changes. We do exam.save and then I pass the record I can uh, give a rank as first so this is a first rank and I can name it as demo let's see what happens so when I when I'm trying to save it it's it it says that it has inserted it because there was no ID or if the ID is there it's not matching right let's try and find the same record again so we say exam dot find and in this we want to filter the find with rank as one so we got this record now again we would try to save and we see if it gets if it gets added or modified so we will just do db dot exam dot find dot count so there are 14 records right now once we save this record let's see what happens so we say it as save exam dot save and we pass this record well uh, let us make this change as demo absurd so this record which was named as demo previously here with rank 1 is been renamed to demo absurd rest everything remains same let's try to hit insert this time you see the response the right result previously it just showed us it got inserted this time it shows that it found a match so it basically modified a record it didn't insert it it just modified a record and uh, even though you call save the number of documents are same however if you don't have the ID I am just repeating this again to make it more clear that I don't have a ID here and if I save a record it gets it gets inserted and if we try to count so before doing this the count was 14 let's try the count is 15 now because it inserted 
So save works polymorphically. Save can um, save the record in database. If it's not there, it will insert. If it's there, it will update. And the decision is based solely on the underscore ID field.